Today I'm going to read Bitty Bot, written by Tim McKenna, illustrated by Tad Carpenter, and published by Simon & Schuster. In a busy robot town, bots begin to power down, all except for Bitty Bot. Feeling sleepy? Maybe not. All the bots and bots were beep. Day is over. Time for sleep. Kiss your papas, hug your mamas, activate your bot pajamas. Every bot is tucked in tight, peace and quiet. Well, not quite. What's that noise in Tower 3? Who in bots were could it be? Baby bot with power tools, breaking all the bedtime rules. Banging bolts and welding rings, clanging cogs and tubes and springs. Bunk! Last, my work is done. Start the countdown. Three, two, one. Zoom in, rooming through the sky. See you later, Betty Bot. Touching down and pretty soon, Betty Bot is on the moon. Taking in the sights to see. Oops, hello there. Pardon me. Greetings, little robot. Please join our grand festivities. Biddy bounces left and right, jumping, bumping through the night. As the party lingers on, Biddy Bot begins to yawn. Creaking, squeaking, moving slow. Batteries are running low. Hurry, Biddy, back to bed. You should be at home instead. Rockets rumble, boosters blast. Biddy Bot is fading fast. System shutting off unless, almost, nearly, maybe... Yes! Softly, safely home and done exploring, sound asleep, softly snoring. Ding! Good morning, robots rise. Time for bots to mobilize. Bright, shiny, on the dot. All except for Bitty Bot.